George, how you doing? I'm doing great. Did uh, what's the transition been like for you so far? What would have been some of the uh, highlights of being in, in Tallahassee this summer? Uh, I want to first. I want to thank God uh, for putting me in this predicament. Uh, I mean, it's just an honor to be in Florida State. Uh, it's been great. Been learning new things. I mean, it's just different culture out here. So I love that about this. And uh, it's great at school. And long before that. To George, a lot of coaches talked about how difficult it was for them to recruit during a pandemic. A lot of coaches weren't even able to go to a high school to watch a kid play and perform. Uh, how hard was it being recruited during a pandemic? I mean, it was hard not to go on campus. I mean, a lot of Zooms. I mean, you can't see coaches in person and get to know the real them. And just seeing them through Zoom, it was kind of hard. And just, I mean, for me, it was just like, uh, Knowing that, like, coaching, like, like they being real with me, or are they just being fake through the zone? So I think uh, the coaches here at Florida State they did well on doing that. Kind of along those lines. Obviously, you're one of the guys who came from further away in this class. How has your first month or so here validated your choice to kind of to choose FSU? Uh, I mean, it's great. Uh, different cultures out here different everything out here. I mean, I think it was different from where I was from. So like, I like different things. So I wanted to try different things. So I came here and it's been great so far. George, what's, what's the energy been like in the weight room with, with, the, with the, the lifting sessions that you guys have? Coach Storm seems to be a pretty uh, intense individual. I mean, it's been intense, uh, everything, uh, like, me, I haven't been like, I haven't been in this environment, but it's like a tense out there and they like excited in the weight room. So like, I love it. Hey George, I know you played football and then hoops immediately before getting here. You came in at 189 according to the roster. Have you been able to put on some weight since you got here? And do you have kind of a goal in mind for where you want to be when September rolls around from a weight standpoint? Uh, yeah, I came here uh, uh, 189. Uh, I'm over 200 now. Uh, using my resources, uh, nutritionist, uh, weight gain, and everything like that. And I'm getting up there. FSU signed a number of defensive linemen in this class, and I know a lot of y'all arrived over the summer, kind of weren't early enrollees. How has all of y'all coming in together, all of y'all playing similar positions, helped each other get acclimated? I mean, uh, it's been great uh, just to communicate with everybody and uh, having, just having people to lean on for real. Uh, just to know they came in like me, so like we just starting off new, getting no play, so it's been like a help for me. I think, I, you know, I remember when you signed, you know, Coach Norvell talked a lot about you know, your family and, and, and I guess, you know, getting them to, getting you guys to trust them to, to come down from Virginia. What, what were some of the ways they did that? How were they able to, to kind of convince you and your family that this was a, a good place for you? Uh, like I said, uh, I just felt it through the Zoom. Uh, they were being weird with me. So, I mean, I felt it. And I felt the energy with Coach Novell and uh, Coach Odell and Coach JP. I mean, it just felt great through the zone. So, I, I mean, I made my choice. You mentioned how much weight you put on, and uh, that's awesome. I wish I could do it that easily. I, you know, a lot of people think that it's just it, you guys show up on campus and it should be a piece of cake to gain weight, and I guess you've kind of shown that. But is it actual, like, work? Are you having to – I mean, can you describe what you've done, or has it been a pretty easy just I'm eating more and it's going I mean, on my boat? When I came here, it was kind of hard uh, just to eat it. But now I'm like, I'm getting used to it, eating, eating a lot of meals a day and just eating a lot and know what to put in my body. The nutritionist, I'm going to the nutritionist like every week to know what to put in my body. And I'm just learning. Right. Hey, Coach, what's the best thing about being 
uh, we, we spoke to Byron and a couple of the guys made comments about Jermaine Johnson and Keir Thomas, some of those older guys who have been helpful so far. Are they are they coming to you guys to offer advice or is it mostly if you guys go ask them for advice, they'll help you out? No, they come to us. Uh, they like our coaches for real. They like our coaches. They tell us what to do and like what's going to go on because we don't know what's going to go on. So like they like giving us a heads up or like how to do things, how to play book. They asking us like everything. So it's a big help. George, I can't keep up with all the positions you guys have these days on defense, Fox and, and Buck and everything. When you're looking at the film from last season or what these coaches have had at their previous stops, is there anything that you feel you fit best in with what they want to run here? Um, right now, I'm, uh, they got me at Fox. Uh, but I put anything they want me to play. Uh, I'm just here to contribute. All right. And then what, what's what's your freshman class like? I mean, I know you got to interact with some of those guys during the recruiting process, but not that much because, like you said, you weren't able to do all the visits together. What's it been like getting to know those guys, and um, what, what's your connection been like with that freshman class? I mean, it's been great. Uh, I like some of my best friends right now. Uh, like, just to get through, I mean, we was talking through Zooms and had group chats. I mean, just to see them in person, it's just an honor and just relieving. Anything else for George? 